Hey there friends, thanks for checking in. Today we're looking at the new Sig Sauer P320 X Compact. New for 2019, there are a lot of new polymer frame, striker fire, 9mm handguns offered by many manufacturers this year. But none have received the attention that the Sig Sauer X Compact has. And I think the one draw that people find exciting is that it does have a 3.6 inch barrel, alright? Subcompact size with a full-size grip with magazines that carry 15 rounds. And it's got the flat face trigger that, that people like a lot. Now, I brought out my P320, all right? I, I've had this for a couple years now. Now, let me, let me first say that Sig Sauer has taken the original P320 and created so many different variants of the P320. It's unbelievable. It reminds me of the the p226 there are so there are like 20 different kinds well they've done that with the p320 this this is a great gun and they made it better with the x compact now when when you look at these this this has a 3.9 inch barrel all right 3.6 inch barrel they both carry 15 round magazines but there is one thing in particular that sig did with this that makes the ergos so much more comfortable and people are raving about the ergos with this you look you say what's so you know what's the big deal there you know, look here you know never a problem this is this was always fine but this is what sig did they undercut the trigger guard and they put that indentation right there in the grip and you add those together and it makes a world of a difference and they they uh, extended the beaver tail as well it just gives you such good control of the handgun that those little modifications make a huge difference when gripping the gun now this one here holds 15 rounds as well both these are unloaded and what what's interesting is they already popped the mag here they, they use the same mags almost you know you can look at these and a lot of people are going to say you know can i use my original p320 mags in the x compact well let's see they, they look identical with the exception of a little different engraving here this is from the original P320 it will not work in the X compact okay it just won't it won't fit in there but the X compact mag will work in the original P320 and the only thing that I could see if we look at it from this perspective all right this is the X compact is that the base plate right here it goes a little bit wider down below just a little bit and that is the only difference look at these they're they're identical exact same thing except for that base plate is just a little difference so let's talk about this x compact and why people love it so much I already talked about the flat face trigger let's let's take a look at that right now i measure it right at five pounds nice crisp break and then here's your reset right there it's a comfortable shooter there, there's no question about that x-ray 3 front night sight green dot there rather large sig light night sights in the back and this is a plate that can be removed and a romeo sig romeo 1 pro romeo 2 or a loophole delta point pro can be mounted on this for those who want to run a red dot on this handgun i cannot believe how popular red dots have become i saw it coming two or three years ago and now there are just so many guns being uh, equipped optic ready from the factory no milling or mod modifications needed 1913 rail that remains the same all right and it also has a loaded chamber indicator on top of the slide uh, a bar that sticks up and, and it sticks up enough where you can you can feel it with your finger but you, you really can't see it when looking through the sights front serrations we can take a look at the difference in the slide serrations we'll we'll check it out this way all right you can see that the cut is a little different and the x compact is modular the serialized chassis is right there Okay, no great difference there. It does have ambi slide stop. But we'll go ahead and disassemble the gun. And we'll move this lever down after the slide is locked back. 
and release and off comes the slide dual recoil spring and there is your 3.6 inch barrel subcompact size and there's your frame easily removed just just take this lever pull it out the the whole trigger assembly group just comes out it is like very simple thing to do we're going to get it on the scale right now and see what this is weighing in at because I know a lot of guys want to carry these. A lot of guys have big plans on doing that. So we'll go ahead and check out the unloaded weight. And we're looking at one pound, nine and one quarter ounces. We move that to just ounces, 25 and a quarter ounces. Here we have 15 rounds of target loads. We'll put that on there. 31 and 5 eighths ounces. Here's your carry round and even 32 ounces for those who want to carry the six hour p320 x compact it is feature loaded there's no doubt about that it's feature loaded and holsters are being made people are excited about it and it shoots really nice just just as much as, or just as well as this does but I do like the ergos and the way they changed. They undercut that trigger guard and put that in there. And that makes a huge difference when gripping the gun. You add that with the flat face trigger, the night sights. SIG put together a heck of a package here with the P320 X Compact. And expect a range review very shortly. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.